effects of wind speed and grid condition. Wind energy is an intermittent source of power. There are variations in wind speed and therefore in the power output on a yearly, seasonal, daily and hourly scale. A utility has to serve the varying load of its customers by the power available from various power plants. As wind power is a varying power source which cannot really be dispatched, conventional power plants or storage facilities have to deal with these variations. The wind and solar photovoltaic power are treated as non-dispatchable for not being available on demand. This means that output variations in wind power can give rise to extra cost due to extra power changes or start start oblique stop of conventional units. If the penetration of wind power into the grid is continuously increased, it might reach to a level where economics of the total power production is affected in a negative way. This will limit the penetration of wind power into the grid. The optimum penetration depends on specific circumstances and characteristics of the utility system. In most cases, wind power penetration level less than 10% of the total electricity production will cause no severe problem and will not cause any economic disadvantage. For higher penetration, total electricity production system is to be re-optimized. This may require integration of some more peak load units or storage capacity plants. Also, the distance of the wind resource from the grid poses another limiting factor as it influences the economics of wind power. A distance of less than 50 km is generally considered as economically feasible. Request it is hoped that this session was useful to you. Please press like button. Please subscribe this channel. Bahut jaldi yeh lecture aapko hindi mein bhi uplabd hoga.